Uh, hey, Odd, if you're trying to clean up the room, you better find another system. There! That's what I was looking for. No, no it's not. I don't want to be late for breakfast. So you can steal an extra croissant? Oh, yeah, but also to steal Azra's heart. Where are my shoes? Uh, you just have to follow the stink. Hmm. You're pretty wound up today. You sure this morning is the best time? Oh, yeah, she borrowed my pencil sharpener yesterday. And? Well, that's a sure sign that she's totally crazy about me. So today's the day. Oh. Oh, sorry about that. I'm sorry for you. That means seven years of bad luck. Oh, Rick, are you superstitious? Well, yeah, aren't you? Are you kidding? No, not a chance. Get real good, buddy. Four-leaf clovers, rabbit's feet, horseshoes are for old ladies. Ah! In fact, I can feel it. Today's gonna be my lucky day. Delarubia! I'll bet you think it's really funny filling my shoes with cottage cheese, huh? You just earned yourself eight hours of detention! But it wasn't me, Jim! Well, if it wasn't you, then who was it? Well, I'm not a snitch, Jim, but you might want to check out Nicholas and Herb. Thanks for the tip. That's gonna cost you four hours of detention for selling out your classmates. Can you believe that? I told you, Odd. Seven years bad luck. Forget it! There's no such thing as bad luck! Sorry, Odd, but I guess you're out of luck. Not even one croissant left, Rosa? What am I supposed to eat? How about some dry toast? No way. Okay, give me some hot chocolate to drown my sorrows in. I can't do that, Odd. The machine is on the blink. Never happened before in all the years I've been working here. <laughs> Tea and dry toast, Odd? What are you, sick? No, not yet, but after I choke this down, I will be. <laughs> okay, everyone, here's the plan. You've got to return to the military base and destroy Xana's supercomputer once and for all. I don't think it should be too complicated. That is, as long as Xana doesn't have anything new up his sleeve. Mm -hmm. Azra! Mm -hmm. Let's have breakfast together. So you can start drinking hot chocolate through your nose again? Uh, no. And besides, the machine is busted. What I meant is, uh, I want to learn to speak Turkish. Maybe you could give me lessons. Do you mean it? Sure I do. Well, um, we can discuss it. Great idea, Ezra. I can't wait to start. Hey, why did you tell Jim on me? You're a snitch. Not only really that, but it was your idea to put cottage cheese in his sneakers, which was incredibly funny. <laughs> yeah, you just wait. We're going to get even with you for that someday. You'll see, you traitor. Mm -hmm. I don't blame her. boo da, -da. Bruha, Dork, that's the word for numbskull. <laughs> well, Odd, I guess you just had your first Turkish lesson. Hmm. Walking under a ladder is like asking for bad luck. In Japan, people avoid anything to do with the number four because it sounds just like the word for death. Did you know that the word rabbit is bad luck for sailors? So is feeling salt when you're on a ship. And I tell you that the only thing that'll bring you bad luck is talking to an odd about dumb superstition, because all you get is being laughed at. You think you're smart, but I'll bet by the end of the day you'll be crossing streets to avoid black cats. Okay, Odd and Yumi, you guys ready for teleportation? Ready! Ready! Then here we go. Energize Yumi. Energize Odd. Well, go on! Hey, Jeremy, we've got a slight problem. Where's Odd? He's still in his nav skin. I don't get it! What did I do wrong? I don't get it either. The teleportation failed for the first time. I guess it's bad luck. Oh, Rick! 
Save your dumb joke so you'll have the bad luck of being forced to eat 10 pounds of dry toast. What do we do now, Jeremy? Do you want me to go? No, you've got plenty to do dealing with the replica. The super scan has just picked up an activated tower. I'll send Ulrich. Just say when. Energize Ulrich. Hey, Ulrich. Where's it hot? Stuck on Lyoko. Disappointed? No, I'm glad, in fact. He's really bad luck today. Ready? Ready. Watch your step. If a tower's been activated, you can be sure that Xana's planning to counterattack. How about giving us the coordinates so that we can go and deactivate it? Due west from your present position. Let's go! As deserted as ever, huh? That's good news. Here we go. Here are your vehicles. Mm -hmm. Jeremy, isn't Ilita getting on the overboard with me? Uh, you know what? Um, seeing how your day's been going up to now, I'd rather you guys travel separately. You are such lamos! I tell you, everything's cool! <laughs> Did you see that, Jeremy? What's going on? Hmm. I have no idea. I'll check it out. You guys get going. Freight elevator over there. It'll take us downstairs. <laughs> By the way, Yui, I never asked you this. Which monsters do you like fighting the least of all? The canker lots. I really hate fighting against big bugs. Blech. Yeah, right. What I hate most are the mega tanks. How about the... The canker lots? Yeah, I know. You said that already. No, I mean over there. Canker lots. Oh. Santa sent us a few crabs. I'd have preferred hornets. Jeremy, do you read us? Loud and clear. Anything wrong? Yeah, we just found out why Xana activated a tower. He's teleporting cancrolots our way. I'm on it. Ailida, Yumi and Ulrich have some visitors at the base. You have to deactivate the tower fast. We're on our way. I can see a cannon in the distance. Gotcha. I'll check the area and see if the tower is there. The tower is in the center of the canyon. Hurry up! Okay! You see that? Everything's cool. Superstition is for Lamos. Lights fall. Yeah! Uh, you were saying? Okay. Watch this. Laser arrows. Piece of cake. Coast is clear in front of us. But not in back of us, look! Nice one, Ulrich. Let's try to buy some time. Good idea. Jeremy, what is it? Any news? It's getting rough here. Hang in there. Eilita and Otter are almost at the tower. Let's do our thing. Here we go! Energy pool! Ah, what's happening? 
happening? You lost half your life points just now. It's that stupid bug again, Jeremy. What's going on? Energy field! That'll teach you to sap my friend down. Jeremy, I'm heading for the activated tower. Okay, Aelita, make it fast. You, me, and Ulrich have got a huge, huge bug problem. And what about the program bug? You know what's causing it? No, not yet. It might be a virus or some maiden Xana thing. Whatever it is, we're not having any luck with it. There's no such thing as luck, you got that? What kind of a place is this? That's exactly what I said the first time we came here. It looks like some sort of factory assembly line. Yeah, but what do they assemble here? We might find that out in here. It looks like a control terminal. Check it out, Yumi. Any info on Xana's tactics can come in handy. What's going on with the tower, Jeremy? Aelita should be deactivating any minute now. I read you. Alina can't deactivate the tower just yet. She's been affected by Odd's bug, too. Hey, it's not my bug, okay? Just my name for it until we figure out exactly what's going on. It better be, because I've got nothing to do with this mess, you hear? It's just a question of chance. Did you say chance? What do you know? You're not becoming superstitious, are you? I figured it out. Hmm? Well? I think it's an assembly line for motherboards and electronic implants. Electronic implants? But for what? To control those spiders, for example. Do you mean those cybernetic creatures in the jungle lab? Exactly what I mean. Hmm, makes sense. But the big question is what Xana's planning to do with all of them. I wish I knew the answer. Mm -hmm. Pretty bad news. William just showed up on the replica. And if you ask me, it's not just a friendly visit. Jeremy, we're coming to the super calculator room. Down there. The super calculator will have to wait. First, we've got to solve the William problem. I'd love to. Got any suggestions? We haven't any choice. One of you has to be teleported back to keep him from deactivating the skid tower. Okay. What do we do, Yumi? You want me to go or you? We can always play for it. Hmm? 
paper, paper scissors, scissors, rock. rock. <sighs> scissors cut paper, don't they? <sighs> Get ready, William. We're good, Jeremy. I'm the one who's going. De-energize, you move. Good luck. You too. Yumi, wake up! William's coming! <laughs> yeah, I know, William, and I'm glad to see you too. Jeremy, the super calculator's infested with canker lots over here. What's holding Ilya up? She's just about ready to enter the tower. <sighs> Jeremy, I finally got here. Great. Don't waste any time. <sighs> Jeremy! <sighs> I don't believe this. Ulrich, Ilya just got devirtualized. It looks like you're on your own with the canker lots. Look, I know I'm good, but there are seven of these creeps. I could go down on this, and that'll blow the whole mission. Try to hold out until Yumi's finished her combat. If she beats William, she can come back and give you some help. Roger. Yumi, get ready for another teleportation. Ulrich needs your help. Okay. Uh, no, hold on. I'm all bugged up. I'm too late. Can't believe how jinxed we are today. What is this dumb bug anyhow? That's exactly what I'm about to find out. It's a mandel bug. A what? A bug in the virtualization software, and the causes are so complex that its behavior seems totally chaotic. And with no way to tell if the behavior is really chaotic or just seems to be, it's impossible to differentiate it from a boar bug or a heisen bug. Huh? Couldn't be any more clear. You mean it? No. It's an extremely unusual problem, and Jeremy doesn't know how to fix it yet. Oh, huh. why didn't he say so? Oh, great. That's all we needed now. Ulrich. I bet you want some good news. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I don't have any. To make a long story short, you're still on your own, the tower's still activated, and you're probably going to get the bug I can't fix. Is that all? No. Uh, you've got to work fast, because Xana also sent in some tarantulas to blow up this kid. Great. Ready to rumble, guys? Here we go. Hey, did you see that? Ulrich just knocked off three of them. But how did he do that? He's only got two sabers. Incredible, there goes another one. He's on a lucky streak today. <laughs> yeah! Yes, that's that. Nice going. Now get rid of the supercomputer. Better hurry, you're fading fast. The replica is disappearing too. What about this kid? Hey, no sweat. I made a little remote control piloting program for emergencies just like this one.
another replica bites the dust. Fantastic! Who's the man today, guys, huh? Well, what do you think? Look, buddy, that's what I think. I knew you'd say that. Hmm. <laughs> What'd you do now? What does it look like? I slipped. I guess I can't deny it. Ever since I broke that mirror, I've been jinxed. Relax, Odd. Jinxes don't exist. Luck does, but it changes. Yeah, the only question is when. Hmm. Lady Luck might be smiling at me already. Ta-da! Asra is mobile. Look, she left behind on purpose just so I would find it. Are you sure? Sure I am. Now I've just got to wait for her to call me to get it back. Hmm? I'd like to get my cell phone back. Meet me under the arches right away. See you guys later. I've got a day with Cupid. Great. Tell Cupid we said hi. Good luck. It's already good. So long. Azra? No, it's Jim Morales. Uh, oh, sorry, Jim, but you see, I'm waiting to meet somebody, so if you don't mind... So was you found my cell phone. Huh? Uh, you mean it's yours? Yeah, that's right. Why? Because, I mean, uh, I mean, it's not your style. I like pink. Got a problem with that? Look at the color that you wear all the time. Yeah, but pink with sparkles and a heart charm on it? Isn't that a bit too much? Probably. <clears throat> but I'd rather not talk about it. <laughs> 